Welcome to the 22 Minute Update. I'm Bob Kerr. Well, it's official. Toronto has spoken and they said, we want another rich white guy to run our city. John Tory is the new mayor elect of Toronto defeating Doug Ford and Olivia Chow. And in her concession speech, Olivia Chow had this to say. People are living in poverty. Yeah. Woo! People living in poverty. Can I get a what, what, and or a dollar? I mean, why would anyone cheer for too many people living in poverty? It's occurring to me that Olivia Chow lost because no one is actually listening to her. <laughs> and Doug Ford's camp, on the other hand. I want to congratulate John Tory and his team on a job well done. No, 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 please, please show some respect. No, no, the man won for crying out loud. <laughs> Ford Nation is a real thing. And the people in Ford Nation love Robin Doug Ford. So I gotta wonder, how do they feel about John Tory winning the election? It's like ISIS coming to Toronto. That's how bad it is. <laughs> that comparison is so extreme. I have to imagine she uses it a lot. It's raining Saturday? That's like ISIS coming from the sky. You think I'm being completely irrational? That's like ISIS coming to Toronto. So now let's look to the big winner, John Tory. The only reason I am standing here tonight is because for eight months, I stood on your shoulders. Oh, thank God. I can't hear you over the searing pain from my shoulders because you've been standing on them for eight freaking months. During his acceptance speech, John vowed to hit the ground running. We will get Smart Track up and running in seven years. Oh, seven years. What a convenient number. Let me guess what your platform is in four years. I need three more years. <laughs> well, that's what we got for this week. Tune in this Tuesday at 8.30 for a brand new episode of 22 Minutes. It'll be like ISIS coming to Toronto. Until then, I'm Bob Kerr saying, keep standing on guard for the Canada. Yeah.